You were nothing before you were you. And before that, you were... I don't know. I have no idea. And you don't have any idea either. We spawned on this floating rock at a random time in history with no purpose and no idea if we were anything before we were us. But somehow, there are people that can tell us our past lives. So we're gonna find out right now. How the hell am I gonna find that out? How am I gonna find that out? Internet. I wasn't looking that long and hard for anything because I found the answer to how I'm going to do this experiment from a familiar friend. doing that definitely not you are definitely not watching me try to do that right now thankfully i found a trustworthy website that told me my past life for absolutely zero dollars and the information was mind-blowing what i used to be a general in the year 1325 for context this is probably what i look like and this was where i lived so i gotta lead people <sighs> How the hell am I gonna lead people? I have no cause or any purpose for doing that. Thinking. Potato salad. Okay, here is plan. I go to park with big sign that says join revolution and bring clipboard for followers to sign. Revolution purpose is to get rid of all potato salad, all time. Bad. Horrible. Ugh. Thomas gets at least five follower in campaign, prove he is good leader, then successfully live past life. Time to make campaign. This plan was foolproof. All I had to do was find five people to sign my clipboard. But apparently that was a big problem. Okay, so the problem is, I just started trying to be a YouTuber, so this is gonna be the first time I'm ever going outside and interacting with people. But the biggest problem of them all is that I have no leadership experience whatsoever. So I have no idea how this is going to go. But the only way to find out is just to- I arrived at the park excited, but a little nervous. But it turned out that there's nobody here. And at that moment, there weren't any. I just had to be a little patient. So I activated the first method. Waiting until people walked near me because I didn't want to bother anyone. Join the revolution. Join. Join the revolution. The self-promotion was not attracting anyone. So it was time for method two. I really don't want to go up to people, but that's what I'm gonna have to do. I found a guy somehow, and it was finally time to bloom into a fully-fledged YouTuber. And for some reason, luck was on my side. Hey, guy. I got a question for you. Do you like potato salad? Really? Let's go! Can I get you to sign a fake name on this clipboard? Let's go! Starting the potato salad revolution. This is our first guy. I'm excited to see what you write down. Thank you so much. Sorry for bothering you. No, oh my god. Thank you! I got a signature on my first attempt! Can you believe that? But he left immediately after. I think I scared him. I mean, if you saw this walking around a park, you would be scared too. But look at the signature! John Wilson, you will always be in our hearts. I got so hyped, I took a trip to the basketball court to see if there were any players. But what I found was a no golfing sign at the basketball court, but they could not stop me. I also hit that three too, can you believe it? Oh my god, that's a- that's a dead squirrel. Oh, that's two dead squirrel. 
why there's so many dead squirrels. I was going to say that it sucks going up to these people because they're just trying to like, I don't know, it's Friday. They're going out and having a, a good day with their people. I don't like bothering people. I then went on a rampage of bothering people. Can I ask you guys a question? Excuse me? Can I ask you guys a question? Can I ask you guys a question? You're good? I got rejected. But then I met a man with two giant dogs that looked like small black bears. But he was not like us. Can I ask a quick question? Do you like potato salad? You do? Oh, okay, sorry for wasting your time. And then another one. Do you like potato salad? You do? Oh. I'm trying to find people that don't like potato salad. <laughs> That's all right, have a good day. There's nobody here. So I packed up and went to a significantly better park with a lake. Look at that lake. Okay, we better go till we can't no more. I found a great tree to sit under next to a path that lots of people were walking on. So I just had to play the waiting game. Then, they started coming in. Hey, do you like potato salad? I do. Oh. I do. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey guy, do you like potato salad? You don't like potato salad? Do you like potato salad? And it was at that moment I thought to myself that I probably wasn't a leader in the year 1325. There isn't any concrete evidence of it being true at all, and I just trusted it blindly. But it was all to prove a point. I returned home and collapsed on my bed. I wasn't disappointed with the outcome. I was smiling and thinking about the fact that I actually got one kind soul to follow my revolution. John Wilson. And even though I didn't reach my goals, I successfully created content out in public interacting with people, which I've been nervous to do for a long time. So for those of you who want to create things, let this video be your guide. All you really have to do is get out there and do it, make whatever you want to make, who cares? And don't be searching for immediate results, just keep experimenting and adapting just like I am right now. Anyways, I'm not done leading, so subscribe if you want to keep up with my journey. And remember, you can live any life that you want to. EXCEPT IF YOU LIKE POTATO SAL- I think you should watch that video- I mean, YouTube thinks so too. I'm serious, watch that video! Watch it. Watch the video and have a day.